Greetings students. Today we are going to learn about one of UAE's leading bank, Qatar National Bank. Let us know this company in a much better way. Established in 1964 as the country's first Qatari-owned commercial bank, Qatar National Bank QNB has an ownership structure split between the Qatar Investment Authority 50% and the private sector 50%. QNB Group has steadily grown to be among the largest banks in the Middle East and North Africa region with $104.4 billion of assets. The bank is the leading financial institution in the country with a market share approaching 45% of banking sector assets. Today, QNB is the world's strongest QNB top Bloomberg's list of the world's strongest banks. The list contains 78 banks, a clear reflection of the inherent trend of QNB, which was the only bank from the MENA region to be included in the ranking. Only a few days after being awarded the world's strongest bank on May 2013, QNB has been awarded the best bank in Qatar award by Euro Money to mark the 10th time from the prestigious magazine. Euromoney is one of the most well-respected industry experts on capital markets, investment, foreign exchange and treasury with a deeper focus on a number of key regional markets. Euromoney continues to report on and champion market growth as well as analysis on international gross border capital markets. QNB was established in 1964 in Doha, Qatar. QNB Group has witnessed rapid international expansion in the past few years and has established presence in over 25 countries worldwide, including branches in France, Switzerland, Singapore, UK, Kuwait, Oman, Lebanon, Tunisia, Egypt, Libya, Mauritania, Sudan, South Sudan and Yemen. QNB Group continued to witness robust international expansion as the group successfully completed the acquisition of a controlling stake in Egypt's NSGB amounting to 97.12% during Q1 2013. The group has also extended its regional reach by acquiring stakes in various financial institutions including 35% stake in the Jordan Base, the Housing Bank for Trade and Finance, HBTF. 
40% in commercial bank, international CBI based in the United Arab Emirates, UAE. 99.96% of the QNB, Tunisia, 51% in the Iraqi-based Mansour Bank, 49% of the Libyan-based Commerce and Development Bank, and 20% stake in Al Jazeera Finance Company in Doha. QNB Group also retains 51% stake in QNB Syria and 70% stake in QNB Kassawant in Indonesia. QNB Group has also established a presence in Switzerland via its Geneva-based QNB Bank Privy Susi SA, which was established in 2009. QNB Capital, a subsidiary of QNB Group, was established in 2008, providing an array of investment banking services to corporate, government and institutional clients within Qatar and globally. These include one of the best corporate finance teams in the GCC region, offering extensive transaction experience, in-depth advisory services, including mergers and acquisition, equity, debt and project advisory, as well as first-class research capabilities. QNB Financial Services, QNB FS, commenced trading on the Qatar Exchange in May 2011 and is the first independently regulated licensed brokerage unit launched by a bank in Qatar. QNB FS Brokerage offers a multi market, multi currency trading platform with access to several GCC markets, including Qatar, UAE, and Oman. In January 2013, Qatar National Bank acquired an additional 49.96% stake in the Tunisian Qatari Bank, bringing its overall stake to 99.96%. Net profit exceeded QR 2.1 billion USD dollar 0.6 billion, up by 6.7% from same period last year. Total assets stood at QR 380 billion USD dollar 104.4 billion, up by 22.2% from March 2012. Total loans and advances up by 28.7% from March 2012 to reach QR 259 billion USD dollar 71.1 billion. Total customer deposit up by 28.2% from March 2012 to reach QR 280 billion USD dollar 76.9 billion. Earnings per share reach QR 3.1 USD dollar 0.85 compared to QR 2.9 in March 2012. Total shareholders' equity increased to QR 46 billion USD dollar 12.6 billion, up by 9.3% from March 2012. QNB Group, the world's strongest bank, reported a net profit of QR 2.1 billion for the three months ended 31st March 2013, up by 6.7% compared to the same period last year. These results do not include financial results of NSGB Egypt. QNB Group has recently concluded the acquisition of a controlling stake in NSGB amounting to 97.12%. It is anticipated that the incorporation of the financial results of NSGB will be completed during the second quarter of 2013. Total assets increased by 22.2% from March 2012 to reach QR380 billion, the highest ever achieved by the bank. This was a result of a strong growth rate of 28.7% in loans and advances to reach QR259 billion, while customer deposit increased by 28.2% to QR280 billion. The bank was able to maintain the ratio of non-performing loans to gross loans at 1.4%, a level considered one of the lowest amongst banks in the Middle East and Africa, reflecting the high quality of the group's loan book and effective management of credit risk. The group's conservative policy in regard to provisioning continued with the coverage ratio reaching 119% in March 2013. Egypt's financial regulator has approved an offer by Qatar National Bank QNB for National Society General Bank after requiring QNB to buy the whole company rather than the originally planned 77% stake. QNB said in December it planned to buy the 77% stake in NSGB held by French Bank Society General. Ashraf Al-Sarqawi 
head of the Egyptian Financial Supervisory Authority, told Reuters by telephone that the regulator had approved the offer. Yes, we applied Qatar National Bank to present an offer for 100%, he said. QNB has offered 38.65 Egyptian pounds, dollar 5.74 a share, compared with Sunday's close of 37.52 pounds. The tender offer to minority shareholder must be completed under Egyptian market rules. QNB is 50% owned by the Qatar Investment Authority, the sovereign wealth fund which has led the bulk of the gas-rich Gulf states' international acquisition in recent years, including states in Barclays, car maker Volkswagen and luxury store Harrox. So students, we got to know about the various aspects of Qatar National Bank, went through the company's history to its present market scenario. Hope you must have got useful information about the company. Have a nice day. Goodbye.